What is up YouTube, your boy Jalen is back with another video and today, as you guys can tell from the title, we got 10 signs that a guy is interested in you. This is for all the females out there that are single, they are looking for a guy and they wanna know if he's interested, if he's showing any attention, if he's showing that he really likes them. And I know it gets confused a lot. There's a lot of things guys do that are just super confusing. So I'm here to straighten that out for you guys. It's pretty simple from a guy's perspective. I know from a female's perspective, they could be like, what's going on? Why am I getting played and all this other stuff? So make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe down below. Turn on that notification bell so you're notified every time your boy uploads a video because you're not going to want to miss it. We're on the road to 100K. We just hit 54K yesterday. Let's clap it up a little bit. You know what I'm Let's clap it up because we're going pretty fast right now. The Foot Locker videos are doing great. We're just balancing out like the prank videos and vlog videos and different things like that, giving them views as well. So thank you guys so much. If you're new to the channel, like I just said two seconds ago, hit that subscribe button right now because why would you be on the video and not subscribe when you're getting game for me? You know what I'm saying? So my social medias are down below. Make sure you guys hit those too. Make sure you give them a follow real fast. My TikTok too. We're, we're blowing up on TikTok. We already blew up before. We're blowing up again. We're about to hit 200K. So if you guys want to go over there, you guys can figure out what my username and all that good stuff is. But I'm not going to talk your off any longer. Let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, you guys. So at number one, the number one tip, or the first tip, on how to know if a guy's interested. You guys already exchanged numbers, all that good stuff. He should be blowing up your phone. Usually, dudes that they really are into you, they're really interested, they're gonna blow your phone up, they're gonna text you every morning, every night, every evening. They're gonna show that consistency. They're not gonna miss a day, like they're gonna miss Monday, they text you, Tuesday they don't, Wednesday they don't, Thursday they don't. Usually if they do that, they're usually not interested or they're gonna play you, so don't get played females. I'm telling y'all, y'all don't wanna be played. If he's texting you like, hey, good morning, that's great. That's how you know he's definitely interested in you. If he continues conversations, ask you more things outside of like just your looks, like how's your day been, how's your family, different things like that. That's how you know that he's super interested. He wants to know more about yourself than just the visual look per se. And as long as he's consistently texting you, you will be good. He's definitely interested. Just keep the conversation going. Keep learning more and more about one another. He will also be very consistent in trying to come see you, trying to be with you, trying to be in your face, basically. The more you see him, because he obviously wants to see you, he'll pick up all the call, phone calls that you call him, the FaceTime calls that you do. He'll be ready. He won't probably won't hang up, especially if he's trying to get into a relationship with you. He's definitely gonna do all these things. Number two, they're good listeners. You obviously know what a good listener is and what isn't a good listener. A good listener, obviously, is not just gonna sit on their phone like this and then you talking like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, a good listener is gonna be there, they're gonna respond back, they're gonna obviously be keeping that focus between you and them to show that they're interested. That's a key pointer on showing that they're interested. If they're doing other things while you're talking to them, if they're not focused on you, if they're not engaging in the conversation, then they're obviously not interested. Ladies, don't get played. These dudes out here are savages, they will play you. I'm just letting y'all know. That's how you know definitely if they're interested. And that goes both ways for females too. If they're giving you a lot of attention, if they're paying attention, they're answering with not just one, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, like dry answers, no. If the guy is answering with full, oh yeah, this is what you should do, this is what I like to see, different things like that, kind of like full paragraphs, then you know he's definitely interested. At number three is persistency. It kind of goes along with consistency, same thing. But basically what this means is he's not gonna give up, you know what I'm saying? You may shut him down at the time, you may not want him, but he's gonna keep coming back, he's gonna keep hitting you with different things, he's gonna keep trying to be in your face basically. Obviously respectfully, nothing like stalkerish, nothing too crazy, but he's gonna be right there, you're gonna know he's there, and he's obviously, it's blatantly that he's interested because he's just not gonna give up. He feels like he has the possibility of getting into a relationship with you, so why give up now? He sees in you that there's a future, he sees that he wants to be with you, you're a beautiful young little lady, you know what I'm saying? And he's not gonna stop at all costs. Obviously, he's gonna be respectfully, you know, he's gonna respect you, he's not gonna be up your ass every two seconds, but he, he's gonna be there to let you know that he's there and that he's interested in you, so it's up to you ladies, up to you to give this man his chance. With Shami, I was very persistent because at the beginning she made it really hard. I say this all the time in all my videos. She made it really hard to get with her. So I just had to keep coming, obviously respectfully, keep coming, trying to get in her face, trying to hang out with her, trying to go on different dates to get to know each other better, obviously texting her consistently. And I I'm a living proof. You guys, for my guys out there, be persistent. 
be interested and you can get her. Cause Shami didn't like me at the beginning. She did it. We were friends before that, then there was a phase where she didn't like me. And I had to keep grinding, you know what I'm saying? So ladies, that's how you know if he's interested, he keeps being persistent. At number four is communication. And by communication, I'm not just talking about texting and all that stuff. I'm talking about if he can tell you his true feelings, how he feels about certain things, of how he feels about you, telling you his insecurities and his secrets as well. A dude that's not into you is not gonna just tell you his secrets and how, like I keep saying over and over again, how he feels about certain things, his insecurities and everything like that. They're not just gonna tell you that. So if a dude comes to you and is telling you that, even if he's your friend, even if he's your friend, I'm telling you, usually most of the time, due to have girlfriends, they're very interested in them. Just letting you know, ladies out there, don't be fooled, they're interested in you. At number five, making time for you. A guy is gonna make time for you regardless of what's going on throughout his day, regardless if he's hanging out with the guys, regardless of anything, he's gonna make time for you. You say you wanna hang out, he's gonna be there. No debate, no, oh, can we do another day? He's just very interested in you. He's gonna wanna hang out with you every second of the day and he's gonna wanna go on dates. He's gonna wanna go and swim and gonna wanna go to the park and just chill with you. He wants to be with you, ladies. If you guys don't know this, it's pretty clear. If he does these things, even, like I said, even if he's your friend, I can't stress that enough. He's always coming, he's always hanging out. Your friend likes you. You're getting it straight here from Jalen, the love doctor. He likes you. Moral of the story, if someone is interested, they will make time for you. At number six, they put you first. They put themselves to the side, they're second, you first. Whatever your needs are, they accompany to them, they listen to you, which goes hand in hand with what I said before about listening. You're first, you're their priority. If they're not interested, they're not gonna put you first. If something's going on with them, they're gonna put you first. They're gonna come to you first. If you have a problem, they're gonna try to accompany to your problem first before getting to theirs if they have a problem. You know what I'm saying? So they're definitely gonna be interested if they're putting you first. Okay, if you're if you come first, they're interested. Don't be foolish. It's just because that's what you do when you care for somebody. You put yourself second. You put them first because you love them. You know what I'm saying? So there's number six. Let's go ahead and get number seven. At number seven, the guy will make changes for you. Okay, and I'm not talking about drastic changes like go dye your hair blonde, don't wear those clothes, nothing like that. I'm talking about like changes like. If you females, if you think they're immature, they'll definitely have to change that. That just goes hand in hand with the relationship. Everybody who has a relationship knows. You gotta make some kind of changes within the relationship for it to further and you guys to be on for forever and ever, you know what I'm saying? So just simple light changes. Like I said, you could, probably the people who you follow, if you're following too many, or if you're too social with different females, like for guys out there, if they're too social, like obviously you're gonna have to make some changes to withhold that relationship because you can't be doing the same thing that you've been doing if you're single. So if the guy is willing, to make these changes, he's obviously interested, he wants the relationship to work, and he's down to do whatever for you. Number eight is they don't make you question their loyalty. Okay, so the guy obviously shouldn't be, you shouldn't be questioning his loyalty. I just have to say that. You shouldn't be like, oh, is he cheating? Is he with somebody else? If he's like that, ladies, run away from the situation. You know what I'm saying? If you are questioning his loyalty from things he's done before, and you feel like he's gonna do that to you, once a cheater, always a cheater, ladies. You need to realize that. If you feel like he's he's gonna do that to you, get out of there, run for the moon, you know what I'm saying? Scooby-Doo, get out of there, because he won't be interested if he's doing that. If he cheated before, if he DMs a lot of people or different things like that, ladies, you gotta go, he's not interested. Obviously a guy who's interested, you wouldn't even have to question his loyalty. You'll know that he's down for you and only you. He loves you for you, he wants you. You're what he craves, so he's not gonna go and cheat on you or talk to some other girls or DM other girls. He's not gonna do that. You should never have to question his loyalty. That's what I have to say about that topic. Ladies, just listen, come real close. If you have to question his loyalty, get out of there, run, okay? Get out of there. Number nine is PDA. Now, with PDA, I know a lot of people are very sensitive about the PDA topic, but if he displays PDA towards you, that means he's letting you know that he loves you and he's letting everybody else around you, if you're out at the mall, wherever you are, you're out to eat, know that he loves you. That shows that he's not afraid to let everyone know that he's not hiding anything, that he's with you and only you, that he loves you and adores you, all that good stuff. He's showing it, gives you kisses, holding hands, all that stuff, so you know he's loyal. If he's doing this, I'm telling y'all, this is a fact, females. 
This is a fact. If he holds your hand, if he tries to hug you, if he tries to kiss you in public, public, he is into you, he's interested, he loves you, all that good stuff, because he doesn't care what nobody thinks, he doesn't care about what no female thinks, if a female's thinking, oh, he's with her, or whatever the case may be, he doesn't care. Dudes who don't do PDA much, you have an ability to second guess about the relationship. Now, that's, everybody doesn't do PDA. Certain couples don't do it, but I'm just saying, if you're fresh into the relationship and he's not trying to hold hands, like you try to hold his hand, he moves, you try to kiss him, he moves, or something like that, obviously he's not interested in you. Once again, you need to scooby doo get out of there because that's not healthy, you know what I'm saying? He should be wanting to kiss you in public, he should be wanting to do all those little PDA things. If you decide to do it with him, there's no way he should be dodging or anything like that. So, he's definitely interested if he even initiates PDA. And at number 10, this has to be the best one yet, females, ladies out there, you know what I'm saying? This is the ultimate, you're gonna know that he's interested and that he wants to be with you. If he chooses to hang out with you or chooses you over his crew, over his best friends, over all that, ladies, you got him in the bag, you know what I'm saying? You better not let go because that means he's also very, very interested and in is gonna submit everything into that relationship because those are his boys. Those are the people he's supposed to hang out with all the time. And I know a lot of guys will choose their guys, even if they have a girlfriend, over their girlfriend. So the fact that this guy that you're with or hanging out with is choosing you over his friends or choosing to hang out with you over his friends, you better keep him and you better run to the California desert ocean city. You know what I'm saying? He's choosing you, okay? Don't be blind, ladies. These are simple things that you guys should know, okay? He's very interested in you because he left the ones he hangs out with every day, the ones he goes and plays sports with, the ones he does all that with, and wanted to hang out with you, his lady, you know what I'm saying? So he's definitely interested in you. He definitely wants you. Y'all gonna get married. But that's the end of the video. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you guys smash that like button down below. Turn that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video because you guys are not gonna wanna miss it. And if you guys have any video ideas, comment them down below. I know you guys wanted me in the past to do rating subscriber outfit video. I have a lot of you, not a lot of you guys, probably like 10 of you guys that sent me your outfits. If you guys want me to do that, make sure you guys who are seeing this, you go over to Instagram and DM me pictures of yourself. I'll screenshot it and I'll try to make it into a video for y'all. But if you guys want more videos like this, relationship advice videos, I know I did a lot in the past and they did really, really well on this channel. Make sure you guys spam the like button, I'm telling you. If you guys like the video, it will get me recommended, which will get more views, which we can bring more of you guys over, more subscribers, and I can keep dropping these bangers, these, these informational videos for you guys. But I'll catch you guys in the next one. I love you guys, peace.